Titties make people happy. It's a fact. Whether you're a man, woman, hungry baby, everyone loves a good pair of fun bags. And nowadays, it's simple to see some tater tots. Just pull out your phone, go to your favorite hub, and type, yes, please. But back in the day, it was a struggle. For starters, the internet was slow as shit. Forget looking at vids, it took minutes just to load a picture. And half the time, it would crash right before it got to the good parts. Plus, there were no smartphones, so the only access to the internet was on a house computer shared by your entire family. You know how hard it is to pow one out when every noise makes you freeze like a deer in the headlights? Fa -fa 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 -fa. Fat, 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 fat. Now all this changed in sixth grade when my mom bought our first color printer. It was like my 911, and that the world would never be the same. You see, this meant I could now print out some pics and spank it whenever I pleased. I couldn't even wait to use it. I pretended to be sick the next day so I'd have a full eight hours to print my new dirty novel. And believe me when I tell you, I used that full eight hours. The next day at school, of course I had to brag to all my friends. Most of them had never even seen a before. And I'm showing them spreadsheets like, take a look at this one. Oh, look at that. Oh. And this one. No way. And you're not gonna believe this one. Oh. Do they all look like ham sandwiches? Needs to say, they were mesmerized. I gave them a few free ones because they were my homies, but the next day they asked for more. And I was like, guys, chill, I can't print these out every day. And my buddy says, well, what if I paid you? And I'm like, paid me? I had never even thought I could earn money off this, but as soon as he mentioned the idea, all I saw was dollar signs. After a few days, word spread and tons of guys were coming up to me. It was like I instantly became popular. In a very short period of time, I went from relative unknown to porn kingpin. And the funniest part was, I got to see who the real deviants were. You see, most guys would just buy whatever I had in stock, but every once in a while, I'd get requests. One kid named Jimmy asked if I could get a picture of a naked girl drinking toilet water. And even in middle school, I'm like, oh, this kid's definitely gonna be a serial killer. So weeks went by and the money was flowing. I never had a job or a allowance, so getting paid every day was such an incredible feeling. But as the money increased, so did my ego, and I became way too cocky. Like at first I was cautious, only doing transactions in the back of the bus, but after a few days, I'd just be handing out pics in the middle of the cafeteria like, hey you guys looking for Britney Spears? I got you fam. And my risks at home also began to increase. I went from only printing out pics when no one was home to, eh, my sister's asleep, I could print out a few more. I wasn't even covering my tracks at a point, only deleting my internet search history, but forgetting to delete my downloads, this eventually led to my downfall. As one day during breakfast, my mom says, so you really like Britney Spears, huh? And I'm like, what? She goes, I found the naked pictures on the computer. And my heart sank. A wave of embarrassment washed over me that I never felt before. At first, I'm denying it, but my mom just sat there laughing, knowing it was definitely me. So the jig was up, and I was like, well, better close up shop. So I proceeded to tell all the guys at school that I was no longer in business. They were disappointed, and I thought I'd go back to being unpopular. But then, the weirdest thing happened. Everyone still treated me like I was the man. It was like I didn't lose any fame that I built for myself. And at first, I didn't understand why, but then I was like, oh, it's because I have blackmail on half the school. I mean, at any point, if someone pissed me off, I could just be like, Billy Jack's off to anime, and everyone will believe me. In total, I ended up making $178.50, which is kind of incredible. Not because it's a lot of money, but because it's so many transactions. I mean, I was only charging a dollar or two per photo, and at any point, if a kid got caught, they would narc on me immediately. Middle schoolers can't keep a secret, and they sure as shit ain't loyal. So the fact I got away with it for weeks and suffered no repercussions at school was kind of remarkable. So what did I learn from this? Well, a few things. One, to cover my tracks better whenever I'm looking at porn. Two, if you're good at something, never do it for free. And most importantly, three, blackmail is a great way to make friends. Mm, you know what you want to do? Oh, you want to push that subscribe button. Oh, push the button. Push the button.